Hello, everybody. Thank you once again for joining me. It's Poet WP. I'm about to read you a bit of prose. Um, and this is copyrighted under my pseudonym. My pen name is uh, all my things are all my writings under the name Gabriel Samadhi. <laughs> Excuse me. This is called <clears throat> A New Way Emerges. They have driven our institutions into a ditch. The powers that be allowed their avarice, filled greed, and lust for power to destroy so much. I mean, just look at the EPA. Now it's the Environmental Pollution Agency. They are literally going to poison us all. They ha they've already started. They've taken away all the regulations. <laughs> it's up to us citizens now to vote them out of office. Until we take the money out of politics, the grifters and those who wish to abuse power and exploit the earth and its people will always rise to the top like a turd that won't flush. If we continue on in the manner we have been if we obey the status quo and go along to get along, our society will perish. <clears throat> we will change. We will cut away the cancer of corruption. We will bring a new age of compassion. Their evil works can no longer be hidden in this new age emerging in this new emerging age any longer. Too much information has already been disseminated. You can't put the toothpaste back in the tube, as they say. It's game over for these parasitic pieces of shit. The great upheaval will be one of the mind. Perceptions will shatter en masse like contrary glass houses. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> what will shatter them will be the voice of God revealing the truth and unraveling the great deceptions of society <clears throat> that took over a hundred years to root in the zeitgeist of our culture. As, as the great St. George would say, that being George Carlin, it's all bullshit, folks, and it's bad for you. Manifest your own new realities. Like they said in Dune, fear is the mind killer. Don't live in fear. Find joy and live in happiness. It all starts with your own thoughts. Your worst enemy cannot harm you as much as your own thoughts left unguarded. So saith Gautama Buddha in the great sayings of the Buddha, the Dhammapada. Also, he says, All that we are begins with our thoughts. With our thoughts, we shape the world. Speak or act with an impure mind, and trouble will follow you as the wheel that follows the ox that draws the cart. Okay? Also, Buddha said this in the great sayings of Buddha, the Dhammapada. These are universal truths that are inescapable. You would be wise to consider them and learn the real nature of reality by understanding them. Do not do the work that brings you joy and fulfillment. We all have our own unique paths. We must all find them on our own to find fulfillment to a large degree. To a large degree, you got to look within. you got to find your own way. It's all tailored for you. The, the stamped out man, mass manufactured way is not the way. We all have to find our own way. And our own way can be that of other ways. But it doesn't have to be entirely one way. If you seek eternal fulfillment, you should seek that of the soul or spirit. The path of self-mastery has many gateways that change one's character. With self-mastery comes self-awareness. Then comes awareness of the world and the true nature of reality, and how it is manipulated and controlled by those in power, and by those with the most money, and that's really what it's about. It's controlled by those with the most money, and they're all sociopaths. There is an order to it all, 
and the model it is based on is that of slavery. Just do like 20 minutes of critical thinking on that statement. You'll see exactly what I'm talking about if you're capable of it. Do you think the cows know when, when they are in the slaughterhouse? You think they know it's coming? Now is the time for the awakened to step up and speak out and be the change you want to see in the world, as Gandhi said. It is our time. It is ours for the taking. It is needed. And it will be done. So let it be, as it is the will of the Creator, with the power and the direction of St. Michael the Archangel, with all the choirs under His command. In the name of Yeshua, Jesus Christ, our Savior, who is the light of the world. Amen. The coming of the cosmic Christ is upon us. And now, I'll quote Rage Against the Machine lyric. So, it's about to get loud, so everybody turn down your, uh, turn down your headphones, turn down your speakers a little bit. Because I'm about to drop it. Heavy. <clears throat> so, this is from the song <clears throat> Wake Up by Rage Against the Machine. And I'm not going to do it justice, but I'll do my best, okay? <clears throat> In three, two, one. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! How long? Not long, cause what you reap is what you sow. Ugh.